Austru, Austru, dragă trăguță, Mi-ai cerut ciora cu panglicuță, Și-ai mai vrea, și-ai mai vrea, și-ai mai vrea la tale, Să-ți cumpere neica și sandale. Shabbat shalom, that we're discussing here with Rabbi Asa, the fate of the Bulgarian Jewry and also the Bulgarian Jewry that did not have Bulgarian citizenship or passport that were the annexed territories given by the Nazis to uh, King Boris III, in particular Trace and uh, Macedonia. So Rabbi Asa, please continue. Thank you. The Jews of Trace and Macedonia did not have a prayer or a chance. They didn't have the Bulgarian citizenship, unfortunately, and because Greece and Yugoslavia were conquered territories by the Nazis, and many of us know or remember the story of, of Greece, uh, basically that Mussolini tried to conquer Greece and it could not the Italian army could not defeat the, the, the Greeks and then Hitler in, in his bad temper or in a day of, 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 of bad news uh, dismissed Mussolini like he was in nothing and said I am going to show you how we conquer uh, Greece and he did it with great cruelty. At any rate the Jews of those two territories did not have a chance to survive. They were taken to Treblinka and they perished within hours of their arrival. Didn't you tell me at some other point that there, there were a few survivors, a hundred and some survivors yeah. that still have they, they uh, resettled exactly. in Israel? Yeah. Uh, uh, approximately 142 survivors uh, somehow uh, um, um, made it out. Made it out, and uh, there's a very strong association in Israel of the Greek and uh, of the uh, Macedonian and Thracian Jews, who literally went berserk when I in 1990 six planted a forest in Israel to honor Bulgaria. So let me focus for a moment on 1996 because this will show the politics of the Holocaust even in the state of Israel. Uh, my friend Jacob Gerasi, who now lives in Sofia, and I, and Jacob was resident of of California. Um, uh, he came here as a student, he married a, a wonderful um, uh, uh, American uh, person. J Jacob Jurassic is from where actually? Uh, he's from Sofia. Uh, he's a Bulgarian. Bulgarian who survived the Holocaust, uh, came to Israel. His father was killed by Arab uh, terrorists in Galilee oh, about 40 years ago and Jacob um, and I, Jacob used to work for me as a teacher in our temple, in our schools. Here in California. In California. So he got his degree at Stockton, uh, California, then came to Cal State Fullerton for graduate studies and uh, uh, I was not only his is uh, employer at the, at the temple, but Temple we also, in Temple Fullerton. In Fullerton, but we became also good friends. We decided in 19, and I will go now back into communist territory right. for a moment. Right. In 1986, we decided that we're going to invite the Bulgarian ambassador to Washington, D.C. to come to the West Coast and to uh, tell us about Bulgaria. So we hosted him. As a matter of fact, the only time in my life that I had a chauffeur's cap on my head is uh, I didn't have a decent car to drive. We didn't have any money. I mean, we were paupers or schleppers, you know, nothing. Uh, but I 
borrowed a beautiful Lincoln Continental nice limousine. Thing. Well, no, it wasn't a limousine, it was a private car, but uh, like beautiful. Like a limousine, yeah. yeah. like a limousine from the president of our temple at that time, which was General Garner. And uh, I picked up the ambassador from the airport. I introduced myself as Rabbi Asa, and I'll be your driver, etc., etc. And we had the communist ambassador uh, uh, for four days. He, he, he made a number of uh, speeches. One of them was at the Sephardic Synagogue on Wilshire Boulevard, Tiferet in Los Israel. Angeles. Yeah, Tiferet, Israel. Sure. Tiferet, Israel, where many Bulgarian Jews were at that time members uh, there, or uh, Sephardic Jews from Greece, Turkey, etc. Et and, uh, of course, uh, we were hoping that this will give us an entree or entry into doing Jewish tourism in Bulgaria to thank Bulgaria for what they've done. Of course. So, what happened is that we, we started working with a travel agency. We had 350 Americans, mm -hmm. Jews and Christians, into seven subgroups to go and give thanks to Bulgaria. So the groups were, for example, group of folk dancers who used to dance Bulgarian dances every every week at their uh, folk dance uh, classes, who wanted to visit the place in Bulgaria where they teach folk dancing, which uh, which is, there's a famous uh, village up there in Bulgaria that has got constant uh, seminar of folk dancing. What's the name of this? Um, I don't remember the name of the of the village. The but, name of the mountains? Uh, probably the Balkans. The uh, Balkan I'm not sure. Um, yeah. Well, let's get back to our yeah. story. Uh, there was a group of Bulgarian Christians who wanted to go back to Bulgaria, even though they were not communists, right. they wanted to visit and acknowledge the the country in which they were born. There were some professors mm -hmm. from USC, from uh, UCLA, from different uh, colleges and institutions. And of course, the majority was Jewish people who wanted to come and thank Bulgaria. But connect us to what happened when you wanted to plant the tree in Israel, because that's, right. that's what we kind of made the big uh, exactly. detour. So this was the first attempt. That's in 1986. Uh, it, uh, it was the day, the week that Israel bombed the nuclear reactor in Iraq. The nuclear reactor was bombed on June 11th, I believe, or 12th, 1986. And our trip was to depart the next week. Right. Okay. Uh, I will tell you in the next segment. Just tell us, can you connect us yeah. to the, I think we have another yeah. minute. Just yeah. connect us to the whole thing that happened in, uh, with okay. the tree planting. What year was that in? Uh, when uh, the Macedonian and exactly. the Croatian community exactly. got upset. All right, so we will uh, talk. Yeah. I'll, okay. I'll, I'll give you the dates uh, the in the next in, in the, the next, next segment. segment. Very okay. good. Sorry, we're stumbling here. It's uh, we're getting ready for Shabbat, so we're kind of stumbling. It's uh, May seventeenth, uh, Friday, two thousand and thirteen, in beautiful Fullerton, sunny Fullerton, California. Thank you very much, uh, Rabbi Thank you, David. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. Ai mai vrea, ai mai vrea drăguță, Ana, Ca să te îmbrac, măi, cu o năframă. Să-ți cumpăr, să-ți cumpăr cercei, măi, Ana, Dar eu n-am de unde, măi, cu o dară. Auzi, dragă, fata, nechi, dragă, Aseară, bolivă, tamiceană. Și acum nu spărale, Să-ți cumpăr sandale, Buzunarele sunt goale, da Mai apoi drăguță, încă o băncuță Și băui în colitru